she's stronger on, on gun control. Yeah. And what happened, guys? Why haven't we been able to ban assault weapons? What happened with that? You know, and don't get me wrong, I'm, I'm not anti-gun. I grew up around guns. You know, my father's in the military, so, you know, we, we, we had guns in the house, you know, my, it was, my, my father, not my mother. I don't want you to think my mother was walking around the house packing or anything, you know. <laughs> Eat your peas. <laughs> well, maybe shoot them peas off your plate. So I'm not saying take away all guns. I just think there's some guns you shouldn't be able to have. You know, like the same way I can't drive a tank, you shouldn't be able to have an assault weapon. <laughs> That's all. They're going to tell me, oh, well, we can't ban assault weapons. Are you kidding me? As much damage as, as they've done, and you tell me you can't ban a assault weapon, but you can ban a baby stroller because it chopped off the tip of little Billy's index finger. <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me? Oh, poor Billy. He can't point. I, I, don't, I don't know what he wants. I don't know where he wants me to look and and my heart just breaks whenever he tries to do it's a business spider it's just oh. <laughs> fucking kidding me and, and it's bullshit about whoa I need I need an assault weapon to protect my home. Where's your home? The Middle East? <laughs> and that's what I think we should do. The type of gun that you should be allowed to have should be determined by where you live. Yeah. Yeah, now like say if you live out in, in the country somewhere, out in the woods, some rural area, whatever, and you're like, man, okay, you know, you got animals out there and shit, and, you know, so, okay, yeah, here's a high-power rifle, and, yeah, take, you know what, you might have some hillbillies, let me get you some more shit, because <laughs> I am terrified of hillbillies. <laughs> I do not fuck with hillbillies, I'm telling you. Two things I'm scared of, hillbillies and snakes. Oh my God. If I ever saw a hillbilly with a sack of snakes, oh. That is my worst nightmare. So yeah, so if you live out in the woods, I'm gonna give you some shit. You take all this, yeah. And so you live in a bad neighborhood, you know, bad neighborhood where you just have that random shopping cart on the corner and there's no grocery store within three miles. <laughs> you live in a bad neighborhood? Okay, here you go. I'm going to give you a nine millimeter. There you go. There you go. You get this. Okay, yeah. You know, you might need some night vision goggles because... I saw a shopping cart. <laughs> you live in a neighborhood with a season or fruit in the name. Winter Cherry Grove. Spring Orchard Meadow. <laughs> take this baseball bat and take your ass home.
If you live in a cul-de-sac, if you live in a cul-de-sac, what the, shut the fuck up and lock your door. Don't nothing happen in a damn cul-de-sac. It's not like you're gonna get sneak attack. You see them coming. And if some shit goes down, you'll get their license plate when they leave it. Fucking <laughs> call the sack.